Welcome back to We're Away Island, home of the Kit Hack Model Club, a society of sociopaths who terrorize the local populace with armed combat aircraft, gunboats, recklessly driven RC cars, and oftentimes fighting amongst themselves. And their newest member can be you. That's right, Kit Hack Model Club is now available for purchase on Steam in early access as of the 15th of April. Buy it now with the link below and to celebrate, I was given pre-release access to the game once again, courtesy of Curve Games who have sponsored this video. You may recall I played this game last year, at the time it was called Kit Bash Model Club, but for reasons I can't get into the name had to be renamed to Kit Hack, but you know, the name has grown on me, and I'm once again not alone in this video, I am joined by the game's creator, Felipe Valonge, also known as Harvester, who created some obscure Space Frog game that you might have heard of, can't have played that one myself, and we had some great fun, building vehicles, partaking in challenges, and we even dabbled in some rocket science. So sit back and enjoy watching us have a blast in Kit Hack. Hello yeah, again. Sorry in advance for all the editing work. <laughs> but yes, hello again. Uh, would you like to introduce yourself to the audience again? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, I'm Felipe, I, uh, also known as Harvester. I am the creator and lead developer of Kit Hack Model Club. Um, you may also know me from Kerbal Space Program, but. Uh, What's Kit Hack Model Club. Kerbal Space Program, what's that? Um, it, it's some game about like little green men in spacecraft. I, you wouldn't have heard of it. Nah, sounds a bit boring. Welcome, let's let's take a look at this game. <laughs> Kit Hack Model Club. Uh, I believe the name had to be changed for um, reasons uh, from Kit Bash. So now we are here in Kit Hack Model Club. Um, last time we played this together, we had a little bit of a we had a little bit of a competition, didn't we? So yeah. Um, shall we play some multiplayer? Oh, hang on, I'm on the development build. I need to switch over here. Oh, crap, sorry. Weapon damage. Nothing is safe. Because, uh, I'll allow cheats. <laughs> Maximum part count. One million. That sounds good. Okay, you're hosting then. All right. Let's go. I'm not doing a mission to begin with, so we can just have a little explore. There we go. There, there we, we are. Go. Nice one. You know, last time, right, we had an air battle. We had a sea battle. We had a land battle. Right. But what we didn't do we is did. a rocket battle, which, you know, Mr. Kerbal's space program that and I also dabble in the Kerbal sometimes. I think what might be a fun challenge is who could, we'll go to the workshop now and we'll try. We've got like a minute to build a rocket and then we'll launch them and see whose rocket gets highest. Oh, okay. I thought you meant shooting at each other's rocket as we launched. That sounded very difficult. <laughs> but yeah, let's so do let's, that. Let's do it. Uh, yes, I want to continue. Right, so right, there we go. this was a really bad idea because you're you. probably going to beat me because you actually know how to play this game. <laughs> I'm just going to whack So it. you would think, right? But um, <laughs> I, I no promises, like really. Um, actually... Um, don't judge me for it if it turns out to be like very in the I moment. very much am going to People judge you. People have gotten so much better <laughs> at KSP than me. <laughs> right. Okay. Max thrust. Where's the highest one? Uh, that's 3.6. And it burns for one second. That's no good. 3.6. Burns for eight seconds. So that's working good. 32 seconds. seconds and fair amount of thrust. This is the I have one. To check the arrow to just make sure that the fire, the flaming end, is coming out of the <laughs> right side. Uh, yes. Is it? Does right. the arrow point up, right? So the arrow points towards the direction of the flamey end. Da uh, so, so I put mine the wrong point way around. That away from space, otherwise it will not be going to space. Okay, so I'll put flamey end down, or well, the arrow is pointing down, I should say. Oh, you're like, are you doing like stages? Uh, sort of. <laughs> uh, I'm doing like, like these things get lighter as they burn. Oh. Um, although competitively speaking, I should not have said anything. <laughs> but in the, in the, in the, in, the, in the, as far as sportsmanship goes, you know. <laughs> right, and that's just, uh, <laughs> oh, look at this. Peter Beck would uh -oh. be proud of this. I... I lost connection. You lost connection. I that sounds like a, that again. sounds like a skill issue to be honest. Something. 
It's I'm just quickly painting it. Rocket shaped, I guess. Look at that. Oh, it's even got. This is the E6 motor. Um, you know, what? that's so fine. Right. Um, I'm outside. I'm ready to go. Where are you? I guess, bitch. This is doing. Oh, um, come um, on! Stop wasting oh, time! Anyway. Oh, the pressure is mounting. Alright, um, ready. Um, alright. <laughs> what is <All> right. that? <laughs> Rocket thing! This is. That's an embar that's the embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Oh, you can't even stand it up. <laughs> so, okay, so it might need to be hand launched. Alright, ready? No, this is a. a, a Hand launch type. Three, um, three. So oh, oh, it will be like three, two, one, go. All right. Settings. Three, two, one, go. Yeah. Oh, it's working beautifully. It's not working beautifully. Oh, I got mine lit. Mine where's is. Yours, uh, where's well, mine has definitely gone higher. <laughs> and then we're gonna reignite. I mean, mine is for a belly uh, flop back landing. on the ground. You could say. <laughs> There are no weapons. Right, I reckon just a light, light modification of mine and I'll be good. So let me just quickly, so let's just uh, maybe like this. I reckon that looks good. I'm going to try this again. Right, I'm also ready to go. So my, <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this. Right, let me get my controller up. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Look at that! Oh, it's beautiful! Oh no, he's oh, overtaking me! some manner of control over it. Oh yes! I'm regaining control! I've not regained control. Okay, yours... Okay, yours... Yours was better than mine. I concede. <laughs> oh no, now mine's her... Oh, I'm coming in for a splashdown. Okay, I, I will take that. Okay, I, I, okay, I, that's that's one for one, right? I won the first round. Oh, look at this. An intact splashdown landing. Space exit your heart out. I have zero control. <laughs> <laughs> right, so I need probably more boosters, I think, is what I've learned from this. Oh, At the so risk of just down, messing up everything. Oh, hang on, that's upside down, isn't it? Where's the arrow? Oh no, that's fine. Stick that in like this. Okay, I need to make some modifications. This can be better. Oh no, don't say that. <laughs> is there an engine that burns longer than eight seconds? Where is propulsion? So. Oh, this one's 32 seconds. I'm using the. I'm using this. So is there a way to do radial symmetry? Or am I just dumb? Make way now for rocket thing mark two. Uh, radial symmetry is not. Implement it yet? Okay. Uh, we've got mirror symmetry for um, more uh, airplane shaped <laughs> stuff. Uh, I'm actually quite looking forward now, like on the early access um, phase that we're going into. Um, we've actually got like an open question now for players, <laughs> which is to help us decide um, like what we should be working on. Like there's. An infinite number of things, right? That we could be hopefully that working on at any time. Hopefully, the take home and from my video isn't saying like, "Oh, we want, yep. we want mun." <laughs> <laughs> Add planets. Right. Good I don't point, know if this point. is going to work, <laughs> but I'll have, I'm, I'm willing to give it a go. Oh, hang on. I haven't set the action, the groups up yet. Right. Hang on. Um, just gotta quickly. This one needs to go on T1. So I'm, I'm going to see if I can get this to ignite in the right two. way. See, that one needs to be T3, maybe. Are you ready? Right. Oh, wow. That, that has become significantly more menacing. <laughs> right, ready? Uh, three, two, one, go. I guess. Oh! That is beautiful. And we have stage cut off, second stage ignition. Okay, nice and steady, nice and steady. Oh god, I'm getting fluttered. I am, um, I'm veering off course slightly. 
Come on, oh, aerodynamics. The stage late. Oh, the second oh, stage is disappointing. That is like, we. I think we are neck and neck in terms of altitude. I've got a lit engine, but it's not going the yeah, right no, way. Yeah, I'm just saying. Wait, Felipe, I think. This is very counterproductive. I'm I wouldn't want to call now that. thrusting towards the ground. I wouldn't want to call that. I think we both got to the same height. Unless there's a way of physically being able to tell. I haven't landed in one piece. Oh, this is going to end badly. Let me just, uh, right. I think I've nearly got this. I've nearly got this. Right. We need more control surfaces. <laughs> so I'm going to go for a shorter burn time. Something like maybe. Oh, that looks good. Eight seconds. <laughs> right, so these guys are going to help with yeah, pitch. Hopefully. Come on, this is taking too long. Rocket thing. <laughs> rocket thing mark three. Alright, alright. I'm here. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, oh, go. go. Um, no, but okay. Stage one burn is going very well. Oh crap, okay. Okay, um, I'm winning so far. Oh, this is just perfect. I mean, it flies. Look at this! And I'm out of fuel, I think. That's burnout. Oh god, it's burning backwards. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was... So both of mine are burning, yeah. They just don't provide sufficient thrust, really. Try and aim for the water, so I can survive. This is it. Oof. I I'm on the ground now. I'm just going to add more boosters, I think, to mine. I think mine might do a lot better if the second stage is actually uh, turned the right way around. <laughs> oh, you're in the workshop. No, 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 I'm here, I'm outside. Do you want to do the countdown this time? All right. Uh, <laughs> sure. Anytime. Um, all right. So in three, two, one, lift off. Oh, it, oh, it's I've got a bit of spin, but Why I'm doing all right. Where are you? I've got like a lot of spin. Why is this happening? I'm going to try and counteract the spin. But it's sort of keeping me stable, so I don't really... <laughs> oh, it's in pieces now. Come on, aim for the water. <laughs> Can I see it from here? You know, this is much more um, like the original <laughs> um, like tinfoil Kerbal Space Program attempt. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the original Kerbals. Like, uh, <laughs> the type of experience that I remember. Oh. I feel like I got higher than you the last couple, so yeah. I'm declaring myself the winner. <laughs> Yeah, I, I think I will concede because, yeah. Well, that's it. That's that's Hash Model Club, okay. everyone. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, I did see you were preparing a, um, a right. plane earlier. We can have another little rematch. I did have a plane, yeah. Where is it? I've got yeah, my... Um, um, I've got quite a few, actually. Um, one thing we could try is actually um, get on a proper uh, challenge now. Oh, that's a good idea. Um, yes. Let's so this is uh, one of those things that we uh, didn't have quite ready back at the um, uh, the first stream. And now we've got um, a bunch more challenges now that are working. Um, so you as the host uh, of the session have to start them. Uh, here, if you look at the uh, this here. Here. Um, now you see here where oh, I am? Oh, right. Yes. Ah. Yeah, so these are the uh, events. Under the radar, looks like it could be. So, Fly uh, the height under the height as long as possible without crashing into anything. Oh, this is a fun one, yeah. Uh, what vehicle are you going to use? I might use my rocket. Can I use? Can I use a boat? <laughs> I'm going to stay with the. I'm going to stay with the Omnicol. Yeah. I will use. Which is probably a very bad move on my I'll part. I'll use but, Fly unsafe. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? 
the goal is that we have to stay well under eight meters above the ground or you'll get picked up by radar okay let's go and the faster you go and the closer you are to the ground as you go the higher your score where's rate. my altitude oh so i gotta be under eight meters let's get out to sea oh all right up so as long as you stay under eight meters you're scoring so my best so far is 65 points let's see where All we right, here we go oh you've got 98 already yeah fly unsafe it's a good plane I, I thought there was going to be an easy win for me <laughs> oh, crap. with your ridiculous boat so plane goes to show, like, being the author of a challenge <laughs> does not necessarily make you good at it 246 let's go Right, let's go, guys. I'm getting some humble pie here. Oh, oh, oh. oh I've just up 300. I've just designed such a stable. Oh, plane. you got almost 400. Oh crap! Okay. Huh? Oh, I'm running out of fuel. Oh no! Almost blew it there. Got over a thousand points. Oh crap! Okay. Four percent fuel. 3% fuel! 2%! I'm just gonna get radar contact now. 1732! Beat that, and now I've run out of fuel. 1700, okay, yeah, okay, so. I need to refuel my vessel. The gauntlet is thrown, I guess, right? What's your best score? I don't wanna talk about it. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, yeah. Left. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I won that one. <laughs> Happy to keep doing this one for a bit if you want to try and get let's some dignity uh, let's back. Let's call it a... Uh... So this is going to keep going. You have until the time runs out. Oh, where's the timer? To get the best score you can. Uh, just to oh, the, yeah, uh, to 14 the right minutes. There. You've still got... I mean, in my defense, this is how it usually goes for me in most games. <laughs> Including games that you design. <laughs> I'm actually, like, very bad at most competitive games. Yeah, fun fact, if you get into Kid Hack and you get to play with me, um, you will probably be able to say you've beat the developer because... Uh, Come on. Yes, I've broken my best score. Oh, I've got the fog. I'm running out of radar range, aren't I? Not radar range, radio control range. Oh, nearly got 2,000 points. So we've got 50% fuel, there's still time. At the risk of this sounding like a total excuse, we might still add stuff to make this even more interesting. So instead of just going over water like this and playing it safe, maybe there's a thousand point pickup bonus somewhere else on the map that just might be worth it. Yeah. If I you're wouldn't, crazy enough to do I think it over land. The audience of this video, this the state of this early access is is pretty good. <laughs> We've broken the two thousand oh, point as a compliment. barrier. Oh no. I'm, I mean, I could just continue flying like this. But I, I was emotionally here. disturbed by your comment there, and I, I crashed. <laughs> you would think that as a and developer, that is bingo we have fuel. That's so unbelievably better where's the <laughs> oh you didn't do too badly shall we have a look at another one uh so we got cargo landing let's try out the uh so we got cargo cargo landing yeah that's a yeah. good one i was gonna read out the list but i have to do cargo that, landing that's gonna be a so fly unsafe was a, be a very different that one. Worked yeah. pretty well for that challenge. So let's see. Launch an aircraft and land it on the deck of the cargo ship outside the bay. Alright, where where is the cargo ship? Oh there it is. Refuel. So I've come prepared for the eventual uh, inevitability uh, of what's about to happen. <laughs> Isn't that so. a seaplane? <laughs> it is. I I'm just thinking ahead, oh, yeah. really. Right, let's go. Yeah, I, I kind of have an idea of where this is going, so. Shuttle down our 
We're making a nice, gentle approach. Zero. It's not a very long runway. Oh! Oh! No! <laughs> <laughs> it's not a very long runway, no. Oh, I've lost my propeller. I did, I did you a got 1,000 yeah. points, how? Uh, I'm supposed to be the best! I'm oh. the YouTuber! <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, I see what you mean, yeah. Is there a... can you... is there a brake button? There are brakes if you're using, um, like, car wheels. Oh, see, I, see I'm, I'm just using pl plane wheels, because I thought that would be, you know, in the spirit of the challenge and all that. <laughs> so, yeah, those are very small and... There we go. Oh, right. I've got 1,400 now. Hey! 837. <laughs> so how close am I to your score? Damn right. But I've got a plan. I've realized that guns have, like, they slow you down. So I reckon coming nice and slow. They do. And then... Oh, I see what you're, where you're going with that. Oh. How, how, what determines the landing score? So there's, uh, there's a bunch of factors. Um, it, it shows you the factors when you uh, get a landing score. So it's rating your smoothness, which is how um, like your vertical speed at the moment of touchdown. Ah. Then it's also rating how much you deviate from the center line oh, of the bad. runway, and then how close your touchdown is to that marker. The blue marker at the beginning and, of the runway. Uh, all of that is divided by the number of bounces. These missions are really just like uh, the first in what we hope is going to be an ever-growing collection because all of these missions are made with the scenario editor tool, which is part of the game. So um, the scenario editor tool lets anybody make missions like this. So hopefully they are just like a template for people to create variations and then entirely new missions. I've, I, I think I've got right. the winning. I've got a winning strategy here. Oh, massive! Oh, I that. see what you're doing. You didn't see anything. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Landing failed. Right. So uh, we've got we two go. more. There's like, downward I, I dive. I screen cap this because. Uh, oh, I've got the I perfect vehicle for this. I, I want this to be recorded. I'm ready. This is an interesting one because uh, it's not just about getting uh, a nice downward vertical speed. You also have to land. Yeah, I've got a plan. Don't worry. So otherwise, it doesn't count. Ooh. This is not. Hang on. I'm gonna go with this guy. Okay, I I've messed up my launch, so I I hang on. Right, let me try that again. Here we go. I've got a... Oh, it's a rocket. Yeah. Oh. Right. Okay, I'm looking at yours. I just want to make sure it gets a little bit more that way. Oh, now this is perfect. Okay, I'm spectating on you. I want to see how this goes. Come on, aim for the water. Oh, aim for the I water. See. Come on. Oh, but did I mention about the landing thing? Oh, I'm gonna hit the beach! So close. Uh oh. Oh, come I'm on. Coming back come in. on. I'm back in. Yes! This is going well. Oh! Zero points. Why was that zero points? Oh, did you land? Oh, I splashed down, yeah. But it's in one piece. Oh, no, no, you have to come to a full stop. You have to be fully landed. But I'm in the water. I'm landed. Oh, no, but it has to be a full stop. You're you're now splashed. <sighs> so so that that's not a valid vertical Fine, dive. Fine, let's just use a plane. There we go. Just doing a nice climb. Oh, that was probably and me. And we're doing a dive. My, Here we go. Oh, yeah, now my point's ticking up. 
Let me see if I can get close to where you are. Oh, he's going down. Oh, I hit a tree. No. Nice altitude. Right, so you don't really have to get very high because uh, the points multiplier goes down the higher you are because uh, that would be easy. Oh, yeah, that does make sense. Good thinking. Oh, you no. Be, you should be a game developer. I'm going to try something less uh, normal. Oh, that was 103 points, that was. Almost got you 108. You best score, All nice. Right, I've got a new... Uh... But this is one of the things that we've tried to do as much as we could with these missions, was that uh, to make sure that you've got the chance to... Um, oh, nice like, as Yay! the challenge is ongoing... 172! I have got I this a great... Guy such a long time ago. I think this is a really good idea. Oh, that was a winner. What was your score? Oh! <gasps> oh! Read it and weep. Are we going to get to 300, though? Oh my god. Yeah. Oh! If you can't win at any games, then uh, you can come up with entirely new ones. The Maybe 300 barrier chance. has been broken. Oh. Sorry, I just talked over you completely. <laughs> oh god. There we go. Oh! 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 Right, Look at that! Are we going to break 400 points then? Good god. Oh, that was terrible. Shall we do one more? Yeah, um... Oh! Okay. So we've got one more mission available. So you didn't want to see my record-beating attempt Oh, sorry, then. were you on the winning run then? <laughs> How long can you stay in the air <laughs> while spending no more than 150 bucks? This is a proper design challenge now. It's about... Uh, time and also how cheap you can get so okay. if you're just under the budget you're not getting as many points a second as you could be moving parts of this thing let's see what else can we remove we don't need a seat i'm gonna go for a beam 88p yes right and then oh, the, the bulkhead is also expensive right oh, i'm ready <laughs> okay come up Let's go. Oh, this is three bucks. Yeah, this is proper like budget now. Oh, yours is rocket powered, I see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't know if like I'm going for Oh my um, god, it's literally better than the actual rocket I tried to design for the challenge but we would build rockets. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm really annoyed how good this is. I've literally like left the atmosphere. I lost the <laughs> signal. I literally lost the signal. <laughs> I mean, it's not necessarily a bad thing. I'm still going. That's a 180, 19, 120 points. <laughs> I'm just like cutting to it, don't run. Oh, but if I get some speed going, I oh, here we go. Extremely. Oh, good we've cl we've clashed down. 151 points. Here you go, Felipe. Here's yep. my winning vehicle. Oh, that's not you. Where are you? There you are. Is that just a stick <laughs> with a, a rocket stick on it? just a stick with a rocket on it. <laughs> I've managed to make a cheaper vehicle. Let's go. Oh. Yeah, so that basically uh, eliminates the... Transmit oh, range. I'm doing very Oh, wow, you've done extremely well. I think my strategy maybe was not the best now. <laughs> 217, I'll take that. The two parts. <laughs> I'm really sad that that was like way two better parts. than the rocket I put effort into. It's just a stick with a rocket engine on it. <laughs> okay, let's do this properly then. So, 
I mean, it, it's kind of like the equivalent of the KSP uh, solid rocket booster with a capsule on top, isn't it? Exactly. Is yours, has yours got a fuel tank? Oh, no, it's a glider. Oh, okay. That's obviously the strategy then. I have built a glider. I have built um, parts of it. Used to be a glider, so I guess it has like that um, heritage to it. Uh, where, where are you? But it is cheap. So, this... I've got a great strategy. Maybe. Okay, I might splurge for that second aileron. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm feeling pretty confident about this. Let's go. Should we, do, should we do the rocket challenge again? But now I've got my really good rocket design. <laughs> oh, off it goes. It's still going. <laughs> Holy crap, it's still burning. Yeah, I know. It's gone silent. The sky is dark. I can are, see we on the moon. A, are we on a flat earth here? So, can we actually get to the moon? Is yeah, that like the, the flat end plane game? is... Well, I shouldn't say that you can. Um, <laughs> I, don't, I can't see Minmus! <laughs> see, yeah, now, yeah. how long is it going to take for someone to do a Falcon 9? To have it fly up and then propulsively land on the ground? I want to see that. I honestly want to see that. Go on, then. Do the comments below. <laughs> Because obviously, Kit Hack Model Club is for sale right now on Steam in early access. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It's it almost feels <laughs> unreal to say it, but it's finally happened. God. And what's the early yeah, access price? Uh, I'm not terrified. You are. <laughs> I need to double check that actually. Did you, um, double che Did you not come prepared? This is the promotion video. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if I'm not mistaken, uh, it's out right now for uh, twenty four ninety nine. If I'm not mistaken, it might be slightly different for you because of Steam regional pricing. So yeah. it's a it's a tricky thing. It's a, um, so uh, yeah, it it's probably somewhere around that neighborhood. I mean, you said to, you told me that you've not played KSP two yet, but when it gets multiplayer, we'll have a rematch in that game. <laughs> Uh, I'm I'm curious to see how that's going to look like to be honest. Uh, I I I want to see like how they're going to solve things like time warp and things like that. Yes. Like that. It's an interesting old thing, KSP. Yeah, I, I'm curious to see what the solution is going to be. And that with Interstellar but, uh, as well. But oh, so what just ran me over? <laughs> I'm getting some good airtime on the Omnicol here. For something oh, that yeah. just barely is able to fly. <laughs> God, then it's I'm watching you. Let's bad. see a splashdown. All right, let's let's try it. If I can just end with the right side up, I might even be able to make it to land. Oh, 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 oh. look at that! Oh, there we go. Yeah. Does it have a propeller? Right, oh, it does. No, does it? It does. Yeah. Well, it's the same propeller. If it's not too. Oh, I see. It's in the submerged. water, it still generates thrust. Uh, slightly. The bit of it is still it's above water more, generates thrust. It's more of a submarine, really, than anything. <laughs> I mean, I didn't say it was good at being a boat, or a plane, or a car. It, it's just able to do all of it. All of so it if I can somewhat to badly. <laughs> to shore. So, as a car, this is a. Um, I mean, <laughs> it's usable awful. enough to get. So around. it doesn't have a motor; it just still <laughs> uses the propeller for thrust. Oh, oh it's Whoa. all over. Oh god. So I know I'm aware that obviously <laughs> yeah, this is um, an early access game. I don't think there's like a roadmap of sorts, yeah, is there? But are there things that you want to get done on? Like, what's next? There for is. Um, that's actually uh, something I wanted to uh, uh, talk about a little bit. Uh, there <laughs> is a roadmap. But the roadmap is very deliberately asking questions, because at this is the point where um, we really want to hear from players. Like we really want to hear 
like from the community what they feel is the most important things what everyone feels is like the best use of our time from here on like should we should we focus on adding new types of missions or uh, more uh, interesting like new interesting types of parts or maybe uh, further like the development of AI or multiplayer gameplay or um, whatever else you can think of um, we could focus on any of that but we really want to hear from players now like what they feel is like the most important things we should be focusing on it should be a community driven thing it should be like this is what early access is for mm. right it's uh, I think it's it's about like having the community weigh in on your game and uh, actually like have a meaningful opinion on how development should progress I mean that's how it went for KSP um, hopefully this one is better than how KSP was when it first hit early access mm -hmm. back then but um, and I mean KSP won well, I mean, I, to be fair, to be <laughs> <Yeah>. fair, <laughs> you could have meant that. <laughs> well, no comment well, from well. Felipe there, I'm sure. Because <laughs> one thing that got me curious, <laughs> that when you start the game, at the moment, obviously, We're Away Island mm -hmm. is the only location, but it says choose a location and We're Away Island is the only option. Are there plans for, like, other islands or other right. places? Oh, yeah, and actually, uh, that's part of things that the game supports as mod content. So one thing you can do, uh, if, and that that's something I would love to see. I don't know how likely it is, but uh, it's it's completely possible for you to create your own map for the game as a mod and uh, and add it to the game, and the game will see it as a new scenery, and then you can start playing there and making missions uh, that happen there. I guess now me addressing the audience here. <laughs> thank you everyone for watching this video and uh, thank you Felipe for not only developing this amazing looking game and obviously good luck <laughs> for the early access release next week and uh, yeah thank you for uh, yes. uh, agreeing to come on to my channel again for another little interview. Uh, wasn't too KSP2 centric oh, this time I hope. <laughs> Do you want to could you, do you, can you tell the viewers to like and comment and subscribe? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm not great at this. This is, uh, <laughs> but yeah, um, like <laughs> thanks everybody for watching. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and uh, uh, is this how you guys do it? Am I ready for YouTube stardom? All right, it's been great. All right, take care. So, <laughs> you too. Like, that, we should do this again. Like Absolutely. as often as we can. This is super fun. Next time I will have I will be better prepared and I will win. <laughs> um, I hope.